special teams, just allowing two power play goals like that as you're playing catch up hockey almost? Yeah, well, I mean, the penalty kills, you know, it's it's been kind of a sore subject with us for quite some time now. And, you know, ultimately, you don't want to put yourself down. It happens in a game, but, um, you know, that's a bad penalty to take there early in the third, especially when I don't think Buffalo had been out of their zone for two minutes. We were kind of humming. Uh, we came out strong, then, you know, we take, you know, Probably retaliation penalty and puck ends up in the net. And now we're down by two and we're really chasing it. So, you know, it's little tiny things like that that can change the course of a game, put us behind, and that was it. Like not being able to capitalize on that five on three opportunity kind of took some of the momentum away. Did you like the push that you guys still had after? Well, you know, unfortunately, like we did full pretty much two minute five on three, and I think we got one shot on goal. And uh, so, again, you know, there's opportunities in the game for you to capitalize. And uh, you know, whether it was taking ill-advised penalties, not be able to kill them off, or have, creating penalties where you can take advantage and, and not doing it. So, um, you know, just gonna go back to the drawing board, circle back. Maybe have to make you know some adjustments here and move on. How do you put this one in perspective? It's not often that the Lightning lose two games in a row. So I'm not sure if it's time for a panic, but you know, just you know, you know what I'm saying. Uh, it's just you know, we, we lost a hockey game. We've lost two in a row within you know 24 hours, and you're right, we're not used to it. But you know, you keep playing like this way. This you know, things like this are going to happen. You mentioned the penalty kill, not just one thing, and you make the whole personnel is pretty much the same, other than Andre Pilat has been gone. Just what are some issues you see overall with the way? Uh, well, we make every power play look like they're the best power play in the league. Um, it's, the guys are trying. I mean, they're, they're, it's not like they want in pucks to go in the net, but it's, um, you know, we just got to do a better job structurally and, and um, you know, we got to get some shot lanes. It's just, it, it, uh, penalty killing is tough and uh, you have to, you know, you have to be in lanes, you have to block shots, you have to commit. It's a, it's a tough thing to do, and we just got to find the right combination of guys that's going to be able to do that. You mentioned the penalty kind of took away some momentum in the third period there, mm -hmm. but you, overall, were you maybe disappointed with some of the push overall in that third? to get like six well, shots? And get two I, well, I think we had, what did we have, 14 shots in the first period. I think we had 14 for the rest of the game. So, um, you know, not definitely not the push you wanted. And I don't I don't use the whole back-to-back -back thing. It's a, that's, that's a lame excuse. It's... Um, you know, we just got to play the right way for, for 60, and uh, we just didn't do it. You, know, you mentioned the guys are just kind of a little out of sync right now. I mean, how do you as kind of the coaching staff to kind of get guys back into that? Well, at some point here, you know, we got to practice, and, you know, we get through this heavy part of the schedule. Uh, um, that's what's got to happen.